Today is the day I have been waiting for ever since Caroline Lee set her designer shoe-clad foot into this office. Yes, tonight is the Elton's engagement party where guests will travel from far and wide to celebrate a couple that is perfectly and utterly made for each other. For better or worse, until they die. And I will celebrate never having to work with either of them ever again. Yes, there is an option for us to plan their wedding, and though it may be lucrative, I will easily say, I am Emma Woodhouse, and this wedding is not Emma approved. The irony in all of this is from a logistical standpoint, this was actually pretty easy. Caroline planned the whole thing herself. She chose the venue, the theme, the menu, and did the seating charts. While I basically nodded, smiled, and complimented her accessories. If all of my jobs were that easy, I'd run into oncoming traffic. But enough talk. It's time to head over and take care of last minute preparations. <gasps> Who are you and what have you done with Harriet? Emma, it's me. No, I know, but look at you. You're all grown up. So you like it? I love it. You are gonna be the belle of the ball tonight. Good. I was worried it might be a bit too much. <laughs> When it comes to attending the engagement party of a former whatever he was and his trophy wife, you need to dazzle. Good work. <laughs> Thanks. I've never done an up to before. I had to watch three how-to videos <laughs> this morning to figure it out. I'm proud of you. Oh, it's, it's really not that hard once you get it. <laughs> no, I'm proud of how you handled all of this. You are? You've dealt with a lot and you never let it get to you. Well, I I'll admit, it did get to me a little. I'm sorry. Got to me too. But we remained as professional as we could be. It wasn't easy. I will be honored to stand by you tonight as the event planning experts that we are. Good afternoon, ladies. Senator Elton, uh, what are you doing here? You seem repeatedly surprised at my presence. Am I not a client again? Of course you are. I just thought you'd be getting ready with your uh, fiance. We are, but Caroline is missing one of her favorite earrings and thought it might be here. Well, I haven't seen anything, but perhaps the cleaners found something last night. I'll, I'll go check up front and see if they left something. You look very nice, Harriet. What's the occasion? Oh, I I'm working your party tonight. Yes, but I'm sorry, I was under the impression that the staff would be in the kitchen. Uh, of course, we'll stay out of your way. No, no. We sent two invites. One for you, and one for Alex. Once again, I find myself in an uncomfortable situation with you both. No, no, it's fine. It's only that we have more guests coming than we had previously expected, and all of our tables are full. You know, Emma, you made the seating chart. Actually, Caroline did, but I believe we all had seats. Oh, that's right. Caroline had to do some last-minute rearranging as some important colleagues are coming from Sacramento. I understand, but I'm sure we could work something out. There's just no room. I'm very sorry, Harriet. Is everyone ready to go? Oh, hello, Senator. Good to see you, Alec. Are we all going in my car? I just need to Actually, I'm not car. going. The venue's full. Um, I'll, I'll do my work from here. Harriet! Is going with me. I was hoping I could take her as my plus one. If that's okay with you, Harriet. Oh, uh, yes, of course. I'm just going to go shut down my computer. Well, the earring is obviously not here. I'll inform my fiance of the bad news. If anything shows up, I will have Harriet send it over. I do hope you enjoyed working with us again, Senator. Always an enlightening experience, Mr. Knightley. Mm. What? Thank you. She worked hard. She deserves to have a good time. You were right about Senator Elton. He's always had an agenda. You were right, too. You chose better for him than he chose for himself. Well, should I warn Harriet about your dancing? <laughs> there's dancing? <laughs> Come on, we're gonna be late. Wait, seriously, there's dancing? Wait, hey, no, no one said anything about dancing. Emma, I'm not dancing. 